Hi, Jake here. Just, just going to do the next uh, video in this series. Uh, day 32, I believe. 31, 32. And I'm happy to say that it's been 20 pounds. I went from 265 down to 245 in 32 days, so that's doing pretty good. That's my goal weight is 165, so I still got a long ways to go, but uh, we'll get there. This isn't my first time at this rodeo. I I did Adkins about eight nine years ago and lost about 40 pounds and was looking really good and. And then a couple of years ago, fell off the wagon and it just started creeping up and creeping up. So I guess that's what you get when you don't pay attention. So here we are. We're going to have to start all over again. So a little bit about this video. We're, we're just going to play it by ear. Uh, what you see is what you get. We're going to, I got a few things I want to cover. And we'll probably do it in several videos. I don't want to take uh, too much of your time. But what I'm doing is no different than probably a lot of other people. Might tweak it because the way I, my lifestyle, the way I eat and stuff might be different than other people's. I like fat. <laughs> so this high fat, low carb moderate calorie is is right up my alley I ever since I've been a little kid I'd always eat the fat off the, the meat first and then eat the rest of it because that's the best tasting part so I have no problem with the fat and it makes me feel good I have bad back problems 40 40 some odd years of driving the truck is, has done my back in and it's always in like a three or four pain level and I started this diet and it was really getting good really really met down to maybe a one or less I can move I can stand up without having to push myself up off my knees and uh, a couple days ago I woke up and right back to where it was <laughs> But now this morning we're doing pretty good. About a two, I suppose, on right in my lower back. When you're driving truck and you're hitting bumps and everything, it just slaps the the Jesus out of your back. So that's it. And I and I've had high blood pressure since for the past well since probably 1973 40 almost 50 years I've had high that hypertension is what they call it <clears throat> I go to the doctor and it's way up I come home I check it and it's okay so they put you on a bunch of medicine well you take the medicine for a while then the side effects I it was the blood pressure medicine was working but then it was dropping I'd come home and check my blood pressure and it'd be way low so then I'd get off it and I'd start feeling pretty good and go on it. So they switched my blood pressure up over the years to another one and then that one had side effects that I was coughing like I was a smoker and I don't smoke. <laughs> but that's what you get. So after a while you just can't uh, take the coughing and the side effects of what it was doing to you. And so off I go. I check my blood pressure at home and I'm doing just fine. I go to the doctor because as a truck driver you gotta have a physical every two years. And what is a what does it show? High blood pressure. High blood pressure. Well, it was usually to my weight because when uh, I went in the military in nineteen seventy I had perfect blood pressure when I got out of the military I had high blood pressure 
and I had gained a bunch of weight and some other complications from flying at high altitude. I, I flew in the Air Force, so that uh, had had problems there. And then being a truck driver when I got out didn't help any, sitting in the seat driving all day. So that's kind of where we are. We're going to go through some of my childhood because basically this diet that we're on is uh, pretty much what I, I ate when I was a kid from two, three years old up to about 18. When I left home, I was 18 years old and got out and saw the country and went in the military and my diet changed. And when I was a kid, we ate pretty much meat with a little side dish, maybe a potato and then some vegetables but it was always a high fat uh, diet when I was a kid and I well, when I graduated high school I was six foot tall weighed 147 pounds so that it wasn't my upbringing that, that got me to this point so like I said this is just going to be a wing and I'm going to probably put up a couple of these because I'm not very good at talking I'm I got two monitors looking at me that from my music and as you can see behind me I have my guitars I have a my Yamaha piano here I got a wall of amplifiers over there I got a mixing board over here that I'm talking through through an overhead mic I don't even know if it's working once I get done talking like this I'll check it out see if it's any good I didn't I just come in here sat down grabbed a cup of coffee and thought well I'll just shoot the breeze for a while that's basically what we're going to do is just be shoot the breeze so I don't want to keep this too too long I'm going to make some notes and as we go down the road I like to weigh myself in the mornings and I was 245.4 this morning so actually 19.6 pounds not quite 20 pounds but I'm rounding up today so we'll see yeah 20 245.4 and now this is where I was during the about the 90s I was holding about 245 so I'm assuming this is going to be a set point where I'm going to have a trouble going off but I'm only eating one meal a day I have no problem with the fat. Fat doesn't bother me. I have more more trouble with uh, the carbs and stuff. So actually this diet's working really good. So we're going to wrap this up. That's about 8 minutes and 24 seconds. That's about as long as anybody's going to watch this thing. And so if when I get a little better at talking and a little better at doing this stuff, if, if they might be a little better videos. I didn't even know. This is off an old webcam. And like I said, it's going through my mixer into my music computer and then back over to this other computer. And so I'm not sure this is even going to work. I don't know what the kind of video quality is or anything. So, but we're going to go and render it up, put it up there, and then if it works out, maybe I'll jump back on here and add some more. So for now, talk to you later.